Tim Marshall, founder of Enlightened Equipment, want to take a minute to talk about the temperature ratings we use on our products. We get questions about if there's survivability limit, lower limit, comfort rating, and what we're going for in the temperature ratings and the testing that we've done and the testing that we've had done third party. So we're going for a comfort limit for your average man, right? So that's about 30 years old, uh, average fitness. So if we say 20 degrees, that guy should be able to sleep comfortably to our bag down to 20 degrees with the appropriate supplemental products, right? The appropriate hood, the appropriate pad uh, within the appropriate shelter. And so if you're not that guy, if you're not that average man, how does our temperature rating apply to you? And so let's just talk real quick about that. If you are very, very thin, if you're a man, but you're, you're thin, thinner than average, uh, through hikers per se tend to be very thin, right? A lot, of, a lot of miles, a lot of miles, not enough calories. You probably are a cold sleeper just by the nature of your body type. Uh, if you know you're a cold sleeper, if you know you have bad circulation, um, all of these things would lead you into this cold sleeper category. If you're a cold sleeper, we recommend that you would get a bag 10 degrees warmer than you expect conditions. If you expect to see 30 degrees, we think as a cold sleeper or a very thin man, you should get a 20 degree bag. Um, the same is true for, for women. In, in general, that same average woman, that average health, average fitness, 30, to 30 years old, um, she's gonna need a bag uh, on average 10 degrees warmer than that same average man. So if you are the average woman to stay warm at 30 degrees, you also should get a 20 degree bag. Um, now, if you are, as a woman, very thin or have poor circulation or know yourself to be a cold sleeper, then you should take the cold sleeper considerations also and you should go 10 degrees warmer yet again. So if you are a woman who knows you sleep cold or have poor circulation or are just very thin, don't have a lot of mass on you um, or very low metabolism, then for 30 degrees, you should be buying a 10 degree bag. And so that may not seem intuitive, but there's no way for us to make a rating system that will be true for every person, every body type, every sleep style. Some people like to sleep hot, some people like to sleep cold. Um, there's no way for us to make a rating that applies to everybody, so we go by the average rating system, the comfort rating system. So please, if you sleep cold, um, if, you're, if you're a woman, if, if you have poor circulation, please take that into account when you purchase a bag from us. We don't want you to be cold, but there's no way that we can make a rating that's gonna be true for everybody. So please consider that stuff when you pick your next bag from us um, and have a great time on the trail. Thanks a lot.